your pinpoint forecast with meteorologist Cedric Haynes. Good Wednesday morning, Southwest Louisiana. We are waking up. The temperature is several degrees colder than where we were yesterday, but the good news is the winds have calmed down. But one thing we're not dealing with is, take a look at this live shot that we have for you coming out of Chicago. Yes, look at the snow coming down, the winds out there, snow kind of covering the roadways there, showing us that it's winter time in the big windy city there. It's just not, it's kind of brutal there. Now I know a lot of you here in Southwest Louisiana want to see a few flakes, but right now not seeing that taking place. But hey, as cold as it's been this winter, you never know, it could just happen still. Hey, we got winds out of the north at six this morning, so not very windy here this morning. That's good news, making it feel a little warmer than that 35 we've got out there. Temperatures into the low to mid thirties area wide. Winds coming in now at, at average about five to six miles per hour giving wind chills only down into the lower 30s. Feels like it's 30 degrees in Lake Charles. Feels like it's 33 in Jennings. Feels like it's 27 Opelousas in Fort Polk, while it feels like it's 32 for Derrida and Oakdale as well. But it's still cold this morning. Temperatures will rebound a little better than yesterday. We should make our way into the upper 40s to lower 50s this afternoon. But tonight, the skies will clear out again. The winds will stay pretty, uh, pretty much on the calm side. So we'll see those lows into the upper 20s to lower 30s. So another frosty start for your Thursday. And then by Thursday afternoon, we should make our way into the low to mid 50s. So again, slightly warmer, but still 10 to 15 degrees below where we should be for this time of the year. We'll have some of those high clouds streaming in from the south today, and they will kind of mix in with the sunshine. We'll clear out tonight. And then for your Thursday, a few more clouds will try to mix in with the sun. But overall, no major weather concerns through your Thursday. But changes happen on Friday as the clouds really thicken up through the day. And by the afternoon and evening hours, we will see rain and maybe even a rumble of thunder or two beginning to develop to our west. That will move in with our next cold front, bringing us a good chance of rain Friday night into Saturday, followed by, yes, you guessed it, another cool down with the temperatures. So the roller coaster ride will continue. But 52 degrees today, partly cloudy skies and on the chilly side. And then for tonight, 34 a few clouds, but the main story will be the frost out there. So you're going to want to give yourself extra time tomorrow morning to deal with those frosty conditions and 54 on your Thursday and staying chilly out there for us. So keep that in mind. Bundle up. Don't forget about the threat for a freeze tomorrow morning. But rain chances increase Friday into Saturday and then turning windy behind that system. And yes, cooler. So. Overall, not too bad of a forecast out there. Yeah, hard to believe that uh, being in the 60s is the warm up. Right, that a lot yeah. and it's still below it. normal, right. which is the hard right. thing to believe, but it okay. still will feel much warmer from. It's been a while since we've mm -hmm. seen the it's 60s. It's so. nice to see the sun. That's, that's true. Yeah, that's, yeah, hey, is this for me, that. by the way? It is. Oh, okay, yes. that's what I was wondering. I just warmed it up. <laughs> oh, oh, so. did you? Okay. <laughs> I don't know if it's clean. That's yeah, right. 550 now.